Well, I know my first TIFF uh, a couple of years ago, everyone was talking about Xavier Dolan everyone, and, and his great work, and, and now you guys have worked with him on this project. What was what was that experience like? He's really nice. He's He gives me a lot of notes, which is good, because as a director, I feel like it's better to have too many notes than not enough. <laughs> it's a good... It's a great way to put it because he is, Xavier is like so specific about what he wants. So he, he really guides you to exactly what he's, he's envisioning. I know in, in the story here, we have someone who's idolizing another, you know, a, a, a celeb. Uh, do you yourselves have anybody that maybe growing up that you really idolized or looked up to? Have you ever written anybody before? Actually, no, I haven't. But uh, one, one, of the act, one of some actors that I look up to are uh, Harrison Ford. Leonardo mm. DiCaprio. Han Solo, of course. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think if I... I feel like I did really... Um, I feel like I wrote someone growing up, but no, I'm blanking on it now. But, I mean, there's <laughs> lots of people I yeah. admire. I definitely grew up admiring um, Julia Roberts a lot. You, you were, like, on the same floor as her, like, a couple moments ago. I know. I just saw her. She's yeah, that's very cool. And there's also a really great element in this movie uh, of, of handling kind of negative press as somebody who's in, in the spotlight. And you guys are, are both in these massive movies, and you've been doing this for a few years. How, how do you guys do it? Are there any, any advice you have for kind of dealing with it? I think the nicest thing is just to have um, people around you that aren't connected to your Mm -hmm. business life who like love you and care about you whether you're doing well or whether you're not so you always have like a great like you you have your family I do have my family and, I have parents yeah so. <laughs> and that kind of protects you from like mm -hmm. anything um, you know the ups and downs because you're like oh well I still have the most important thing in my life, which is like the relationships with people I care about. You gotta have someone around you that kind of keeps keeps you grounded through it all. Yeah. Because you guys both have a couple movies at TIFF this year. Yeah, mm -hmm. I have two. Two and two. We're just rolling them out, right, Jacob? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's like a TIFF factory in here right now. <laughs> and for this film, what, what's so what's special about this movie for you? What what is uh, what are you hoping audiences really kind of take away from this movie? It's very. I guess you would say, trying to think of a very mature, professional <laughs> word. I think it's a lot about, like, the influences on a young artist. Mm -hmm. I think Jacob kind of plays almost a young Xavier. Pretty and, much. like, all of the things that had a big impact on the artist he is today and how important it is for young artists to connect to artists they admire and and have that ability to, to interact with them. And it's cool that it's happening at the festival because I feel like that's, like you were saying with Julia being here, and this is kind of a place for that where you know young artists can connect with people that they've maybe look up to and kind of really gone full circle here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Well, thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thank you.